In this video, I want to show you how to buy polls on OKX.com. I have some few assumptions before we get going. The first one, you have an OKX account. You have done at least the basic verification. That's like the level one, which the limit is currently at 5,000 USD. Or you have done the level two, then the limit is pretty much unlimited. And number three, you're not in the USA or Canada. Unfortunately, OKX don't offer their service in these two countries. You could try to use a VPN. I recommend using Mulvad. I'm using the VPN. I like them very much. There's going to be four steps to buy Polchain, PLS on OKX.com. Number one, deposit your crypto. Ideally, you're going to deposit USDT or you're just going to buy USDT on OKX. Then you need to convert your crypto to USDT if you deposited anything else apart from USDT. So this is optional. Number three, you're going to buy the polls with the USDT. And then the fourth step is withdrawing to your MetaMask. So let's start with the first step, depositing crypto or buy USD on OKX. So if we go to OKX.com and I'm already logged in, as you can see here straight away, you can buy crypto or deposit crypto. Or if you just go up here as well, you're going to have a few options here how to buy it. So I'm going to go ahead and let's say buy with card and then i um, just going to do an example here. I don't know, 100 euros. I'm buying straight USDT and then I have some few options here. I think one of these services you can Visa or MasterCard. Let's check how we can deposit. First, I'll go to on assets and press deposit. So let's just do that. And the first thing you can do, you can choose your crypto. You can have BTC, USDT or whatever you have basically. And uh, let me just choose, I don't know, let me see, BTC, let's say. Then here, be, yeah. And then you just say next. There's two accounts, the funding account and trading account. These are just two accounts internally on OKX, which you can swap between these two accounts. So it doesn't really matter what you do. You can always switch your funds from funding to trading. So you have an address here and you can send your BTC, for instance, there. But you can also just choose any other crypto, basically. It doesn't matter per se. USDT would be the best. As you can see here, for instance, I chose USDT. There's different networks here, as you can see, Polygon or TRC20. So these different ones. Just choose the one you have and um, deposit the money. They're going to generate an address for you, deposit the money, and then you're going to see that after it has been received, it will be reflected in your account. Number two, convert your crypto to USDT. So if you have deposited anything else than USDT, you first need to convert that crypto to USDT. So what you do is you go to convert, you go to trade, and press convert then you're going to choose as i said earlier there's going to be a funding account and trading account but in this it doesn't matter you can just choose both and then you choose whichever you had uh, deposited so let's say i had deposited btc you press max for the maximum amount or or whichever amount you want to convert and you convert that to usdt once you have converted usdt you can go ahead and check my assets you're gonna see at the bottom here let's go to the step of buying pls with usdt what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to trade and then basic trading and press spot so we're gonna buy pls usdt on the spot the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go up here and press and search for pls and we're gonna choose pls usdt we're gonna click on that and then we're gonna scroll and then there's going to be two options here. So rather three options, but uh, the most important one is the market. You're going to spend your amount of USDT to buy polls. So you go to market. You can, all, you can also have a limit order. If you know what you're doing and what limit orders are, you can also use limit orders. But for this tutorial, we're just going to buy polls and that's going to be the market. So you're going to go and press USDT. And then I just press 100% since I have almost zero. As you can see, it's not much here. So I just press 100%. If, for instance, you only see it's zero here, you can press this button. It can be that you have your money in either the funding or the trading account. These are internal accounts on the UKX. You need to transfer it basically to the trading account. So you can transfer max 
or whichever amount you need and transfer it. And once that has been done, you just press buy pulse. If it's on the market and you bought pulse, that's all you need to do. And you're going to buy it for this price, this current price. Depends how much liquidity there's going to be for that. But uh, yeah, if, if it's not too high, then you're going to get that price. So that's done. Now let's check the withdrawal to your MetaMask. So once you're done, you can go to my assets. Now let's check how you can withdraw. You go to your assets and press withdraw and then select crypto to withdraw. You choose your PLS. And then, yeah, there's only on chain or, or also internal, but we want to do self custody. So we're just going to go on chain. We're going to go next. We're going to paste uh, our PLS address so you can open your MetaMask and copy your address and paste it in here. And then it's going to be the PLS. PLS. You can select your amount or just click on max. And then you go to next. And I think it takes around a minute and a half and you should have the, your PLS on, on your MetaMask. So that's pretty much it. If you like the video, press like and subscribe. Thank you. See you on the next one.